Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Coral Island. I am the Little Gamer and this is our playthrough of the full release. So we are on Sunday the 7th of winter. We have a week and a bit to go before the winter festival. Um, and last episode we found the fire giants so we've got to go and visit them um because they told us to come back another time oh and our cocoa beans are better quality <coughs> fab so we are this episode waiting for our tea and our snowdrops to grow um because I am hoping this episode we will we will get um, our greenhouse. Um, that is what I am aiming for um, because um, because because um, so we haven't got through much of the osmium kelp level but healing the coral tree is next after that but i'm anticipating it taking a while <coughs> um so we'll have the wind festival and trying to get up to the next town rank um as well so where are we at relationships we probably ought to start making more friends Although, uh, <clears throat> or maybe saving stuff to give out as presents, maybe. So town rank, we made our offering number nine. We finished our barn offering with the goat milk uh, last episode. So we only need the winter to get our heritage up to D rank. And if the greenhouse gives us extra town rank points, um, then we will be even closer to getting C rank, which will be fab because then we might actually be able to buy some winter crops. Currently have no winter crops to buy, so our snowdrops were from the uh, museum gifts and all the tea leaves are from all the wild seeds that I have been keeping all year. Right, so I will um, right, we'll finish, I'll finish tending these and we'll go and visit the giants. Okay then, giants it is. When all giants gather, our magic is more powerful. Strong together we are. We grew can run again. Let's see. Is there going to be a cutscene of some kind? look like it. <clears throat> so here's Gui. Human usually rest in ice season. Mm, no, we don't hibernate, I suppose. We have a hibernation mode, but works very differently. Enchanting. So we still haven't unlocked the third unlock. Although, um, we may need Osmium, I suppose. So they haven't unlocked a cutscene, so it's possible we have to just wait um, for a cutscene. If at all. So, we have got three um, 
forageables to find, we need um, I didn't bring my axe. We need Brussels sprouts, um, something else, and kale. We've got the Brussels sprouts and something else. I can't remember what it is now. Um, I just remember I found it. Aha, so here's our kale. Fab. So we now have everything. I put this down, but I haven't caught anything yet. Pablo. Want to fast travel? So. Offering rose hips. There we go. That's the other thing we needed. So we now have everything other than our growing ones. So we have been working on getting stuff from Ling now that we have our batteries. So we have our online shop. Uh, though it takes a while to load everything and our fish forecast which uh, which is great so we have a bug catching forecast we want to get and a and something else so we need osmium gold and we need all the essences these ones so is Ling's open today? Yes. So we upgraded our um, plants to the next level because I want to put plants in my greenhouse when we get it. Um, so we need to, well, we don't need to do anything, but I want to get all the chips just so that I know where everything is. I can check it every season then. Um, so we now have this one done, bronze seedlings all done. So we've got to do these ones as well as getting these ones with lots of money, but we seem to be making a fair bit of money. So I'd rather get things that are going to help me. Um, so development equipment, we got the fishing. So I want to get the catching. And we actually have everything for foraging. Fab. So we've got all those. 12 grand left. So then I want to get these ones. Auto feeder, which I suppose is good this season. Auto Petter and Auto Collector, which we were, we're basically waiting for on money and batteries. So this one is the quicker one to do. So we get one and the recipe. And then the recipes are about half because um, the sturdy computer took. 10 batteries, 10 silver, 20 bronze, and 100 scrap. But to craft it, it takes 10 batteries, but 5 silver bars, 10 bronze, and 70 scrap. So it takes less, not half, but less. So we unlocked medium fish bait and explosives level 3 for osmium ore. Oh, that's fabulous. We got loads of osmium ore when we were going down. Um, down the mines so it'll be a lot easier to get uh, all the different ores because you just blow everything much easier I think I remember what I was going to say I was going to try that so I'm going to put these away we could try that so let's see what this looks like so insect forecast so we have the giant oh the giant's village interesting oh so it's just I think it must be that B 
bit because I've never seen one actually in the Giants Village. So we have one there. Um, we got that one, an Atlas Moth at Night in the Forest. I think we need that. Garden Lane, Caterpillar, so we can get our Rove Beetle, we need that. Woodlands, Spice Bush, the Lake, I only have that, the Lake in Town, the Beach. So we're not missing too many that we can get. Um, not missing too many bugs. Oh, and now we can... Oh, and diving. Diving bugs. Oh, fabulous. So this is the Venus flower basket. Oh, now I know which area to go to then. Who I'm missing. Blue lobster and arrow crab. So this is a mantis shrimp and a white spotted jellyfish. Mermaid Kingdom, nothing. Mpadpulu. So we have a split coloured lobster we're missing. And sea anemone, red knob starfish, pink mane butt jellyfish and harlequin shrimp stone crab. So the one we're missing we can't get in the winter. It's not that one, is it? No, I'm sure it's not that one. So we can't get it in the winter. Okay. It wasn't that one we needed for the greenhouse. That's a different one. Forageables. Ooh, Aram. I don't think I've ever picked up that. So these at least, um, if we ever need anything specific then, that'll tell us. Fish we can't get. So it's town insects and forageables. Oh, there are our specific Things that you can only get certain places. Oh, pansies. Pansies and eggplants. And that tells us that. Cool. So if we need something specific, the forageables um, definitely help see where they are, but I they didn't have to spend that much money on it. Um... Right then, let's try blowing up the mines. I said that was what I was going to do today. I want to see how much quicker it is with these. Oh, we have the wrong equipment. I'm going to see how much quicker it is with the explosives level 3. Getting through um, the bronze level. Because uh, we're a bit low on bronze, I think, aren't we? Yes. Uh, oh, I put those in there. I didn't mean to put these in here. There we go. So we're a bit low on bronze and a bit low on silver because I made explosives. Although, not, uh, not too much as we have a few bars of everything. So we're going to start at level 30. Um, and make our way through the, uh, the last 10 levels. Let's see, see how fast we can do it. Because it's the bigger section anyway. So we, we just sort of want to blow up everything. Okay, so we've already found that. Well, I am hoping we'll get... Because then you can get all the, the geodes you need. Whoops. I walked straight into that one. 
but you'll get all the fossils and and everything so we'll definitely help with like uh, rebuilding the museum so we've got I'm sure we've got earth gems we still need to find so at least this way hopefully the geodes we get from this mine I presume are supposed to have um, the gems you need So I was thinking about it and actually it might be easier to do level 25, is that the massive big area? It is. Because um, then you can literally just run around. your bombs if uh, if you can get out the way there we go see how much we can destroy so it's not really great for getting ore but uh, stone if you need it and by the looks of it fossils and geodes um, seem to work better bag so we've got five earth five fifth fourteen yeah fifteen fossils seven geodes but only twelve ore So we're not getting bronze ore from the general stones. But we're getting plenty of fossils from the areas we want. relationship up. I don't know what that does. I've never got a pet cutscene. So I'm presuming it only affects the animal festival. Um, so I'm not too sure. So I carried on some more um, down the mines and it uh, it do, you don't get lots of extra ore drops, but you do get plenty of fossils. Um, plenty, plenty of fossils. Fossils and geodes. So if you're missing stuff from those mines, then that's a good, uh, good way to get the drops for those mines which I th I'm, I th I'm sure I am I'm sure I'm missing some uh, some of the gems from that um right are our crops done yet no I'm hoping it'll only be a day or two left um so I'm going to tend all the animals and then we're going to give in all our geodes and fossils on this bright and sunny and snowy Monday morning. 
Oh, okay then. Let's uh, let's switch these. I forgot. So we've got a bunch of fish and bugs, uh, and I realised I'm only missing one bat wing for the goddess offering. Um, so we'll give all these in, and I'll go back down the Osmium Mines uh, to see if I can get that one bat wing, and we can give that in then. These are all our bugs, ruby diamond. So 175 we are on. So we have, uh, I think we have more fossils than coffers. So we'll open all our coffers first. Uh, get all that done. Then we'll open all the fossils. We'll do that. Do you need hair stick? Do you need locket, golden bell, ancient battery? Hmm. Serpentine, opal, quartz. See, we generally get gems from these. Oh, and now that we've got osmium level, we can get those. We've got all of those. Uh, oh, we've run out of space already. Okay. Okay, cleared some space. Pals, onyx. So we get more gems from those. So pirate coffer is the new thing. Underwater tablet. On statue, town model, oversized spoon. Interesting. So a good few things, but none of the gems I got were for the goddess, unfortunately. So I'll give these in, do the fossils. Let's see if we can get any new fossils. Hundred and eighty seven. So I'm presuming that was one eighty, and we get rope. We're never going to use rope now, are we? Unless that they release another mine or something. Fifth mine. Although I don't know what we would get down it. Right then, dinos. What have we got the least of these ones? Gallimimus Claw. Plesiosaurus Pelvis. I don't think we have that. Plesiosaurus Spine. Pterodactyl Arm. Pterodactyl Skull. I know it's pterodactyl. Velociraptor, Brontosaurus, Hip, Tyrannosaurus Torso, Mammoth Leg, Triceratops, Stego. Okay, so there's definitely a few of those. It seems to be a lot more hit and miss with the fossils. Seem to get more seeds and ore. It's probably not. It's probably just because more there's a bigger pool for the geodes and the coffers. Oh, that's most of them. Okay, must be lots of parts. <gasps> And we got 201 donations, so we get a stamina fruit. Oh, that's fabulous. I didn't think we were gonna get one of these today. 
Stamina has permanently increased. What does star mean? What does this mean? I don't know what that means. Oh well. So, collection rewards. Let's see. So we still got loads of fossils to get yet. Yeah. Plenty of insects, sharks, critters, vintage. So we're only only got one missing earth gem. Two water gems, two wind gems and four fire gems. That's not too bad. We might get I'm presuming it's a hat. We might get that soonish. So sending bombs down the earth mine was definitely a good shout. I'll have to try it again at some point. Once I need more uh, ores and stuff, because we've got uh, got 105 bronze ores, so I don't need too many more of those. Right, I'm going to see if I can get my last bat wing and then we can give it an offering today. Glue trap. So combat level five, as you can tell, I did a lot of combat. I even found about 10 bats and not one of them dropped a bat wing. Stamina fruit, of st stamina fruit acquired. Plus 45 max stamina. Fabulous. Got us a fair bit of money. Okay. We felt a large impact last night. It's a random scene. Bag, crafting, glue trap. So sap, dark essence, and any or a trap will catch enemies. Okay. <gasps> oh, hello. Favorite human, finally out you are. Grateful we giants are for freeing us. Now together we are an ancient gift we bring. Ooh, architect desk, this is called. Use it and to your farm, we giants shall be summoned. To any spot, any object, you may move using powers as you wish. Bean, it has very, very long since last with another human, this we did. So rusty we may be. Work for free though, we do not. Cost you some coins, moving stuff will. Forget that, please do not. Now take this item and upon our power, call whenever you like. Thankful human we are. Now that's fab. So if we want to, we can grow a bunch of flowers and then under the sprinklers and then move them around and leave them as decorations. So, oh look, that's so cool. So we can now see a whole farm. So we should be able to even move these. So it costs 50 gold to move a tree. Ooh, 200 gold to move. So it's 50 gold per tile. Um, well, that's fine. We still got to do a lot of clearing. But I think it's more for later on, really, because when uh, when you've got more. Finish, cancel, cancel. How do I cancel? Undo, control, control Z, uh, exit. And it discard changes, yes. So I won't be using that any time soon, but much later when you've got loads more money. It'll probably do pretty well. 
So, but it looked like our crops still aren't done. How long did they take? I don't remember. I don't remember. <laughs> okay then, so I'm going to tidy up and then carry on trying to get this bat wing, essentially. There's, um, hmm, or do we do something different? Oh, here we go. Oh, so, whoops, meteorite. Gold ore? Cool. That was cool. Um, <sighs> no, we'll um, we'll do something different. I'm, I'm 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 fed up of going down those mines. We will um, we'll do some more of uh, the coral sites then. So I'll tend the animals and then we'll go down. Um, into Osmium uh, and do a bit of do a bit more of exploring now that we've got our Arctic desk and then we'll just um, we'll try and get the greenhouse next episode because these plants are taking longer than I expected them to Okay then, so, map, we are here, up by this cave, we don't know, don't know how many um, thingies there are to heal, but uh, we wandered up, we were just following the route last time essentially, just uh, seeing how far up I could get my path isn't being blocked because I was looking for the critter we needed obviously I now know we can't get that critter so a sea anemone looks like a pot of flowers but it's actually an animal it's a petal like tentacle sting okay see I'm wondering if this actually physically leads us somewhere oh it's bringing us all the way up here so I don't know what that is but as we found an activation I will try and work out where that went over here probably and do that stone crab favors one claw which grows into a giant crusher with repeated use usually the right one okay so one claw bigger than the other so I've been clearing out this entire area uh, looking for the third activation stone 
Oh, this cleared anyway. So I obviously only needed the one to clear it. So I just want to see what's up here. This is our highest point. See if there's anything interesting at the highest point. So there's some some coral sites. So we're right at the top here, but nothing overly interesting. So we found seven. Right then. Well, I'm going to drop the anchor here, uh, and as I've got to this furthest point I'm going to make my way back, start here and make my way back down. Okay then, so I found another one, but didn't finish it, but I want to see, oh we have crafting, oh, oh we can craft it architect desk just in case we sell it or, or something I presume. So I want to check our town rank. So we are nearly there. So we've done 69 coral sites and we've given loads into the museum and we're one off. So I'm presuming um, next episode, uh, once we finally manage to uh, give in our uh, last offering, We'll get our greenhouse and sea rank at the same time. Cool, so we got diving level up eight, which is a fab. So yeah, it's been it's it's taken a lot longer than I expected for those to grow. They probably take like 12 days or something silly for snowdrops to grow. Um but uh, we wouldn't have enough time to actually um get the greenhouse wait a day for it to unlock then have a look at everything uh, and if we unlock c rank as well then we've got all that to check out all the new stuff for that rank to check out so hopefully that will get done in the next episode but if you liked this episode please do all the things like subscribe comment and hopefully i will see you all in the next one bye